shape No need to let your food compensate Sometimes we're cooking green beans Sometimes we're making fish But every episode will end with One delicious dish We're cooking up some goodness Here on our little show Welcome back to BB's Back Burner. Thanks for joining us again. Tonight, Kokomo and I are preparing for a little ladies' dinner that I'm hosting at my home. You know what that means. One of my girlfriends will be on a low-fat diet, another low-carb, another low-glycemic, somebody won't eat meat, and another girlfriend's just gonna want food that goes good with wine. Oh, <sighs> what to make? Mushroom crostini would be good. What to make, what to make? A mushroom crostini. Got it. Mushroom crostini. Had a girl. Mushroom crostini is so simple to prepare, but it tastes better than any spa meal I've ever had. <sighs> that BB is full of good ideas. Starts off with three types of mushrooms. We have white button mushrooms, cremini mushrooms, and portobello mushrooms. We're just gonna cook these up in a tablespoon of butter. And about five minutes later, these should be all cooked up and ready. Next, I'm going to turn the broiler on to 500 degrees because that's what it's gonna take to turn this limp tortilla into a crispy, crunchy crostini. Gonna take a little extra virgin olive oil to dress up the tortilla. You know, olive oils are not created equal. Some of them are really bland like cardboard and others are very robust. My favorite is Iliata extra virgin olive oil. It has a delicious flavor to it. It's inexpensive and it's available at most supermarkets. Next, I will take a little basting brush and brush up, brush up, brush up. La da 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 da. Na 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 na. Da 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 da. Okay, next comes a little fresh sea salt. Don't want to add too much sodium, a little dabble, do ya? And some crushed black pepper. Crushed black pepper has no calories, no sodium, but lots and lots of flavor, so I am generous with the pepper. Okay, our tortillas are ready to go into the oven. I'm just gonna place them directly on the middle oven rack. And about three minutes later, my tortillas are gonna be transformed into delicious crostini. Well, our crostini should be ready now. Oh, yes. Golden brown deliciousness. Yummy. Okay. And our mushrooms are ready to join the party as well. Ooh, yes, sir. That's looking good. So we'll put a little bit on this one and you'll notice there's a little bit of sauce from the mushrooms and the butter mixing together. You don't want to let any of that sauce go to waste because that is the good stuff. Okay, looking good so far. Next step is going to be to add some spring greens. This will add some vitamins, some color, taste, and texture. Alrighty. Now I've got Parmesan cheese, and believe it or not, I am going to use a vegetable peeler to peel some thin strips of Parmesan over the top. Parmesan is one of my favorite cheeses, but it's very salty, so be a little sparing here. And over here. All right, 
almost done. I'll add a little bit of salt and a generous amount of black pepper. A drizzle of olive oil, Iliata olive oil. And look at these beauties. My girlfriends are in for one delicious dinner and it fits into any diet they may happen to be on. Oh my, and they're here. Well, I suppose dinner is done and it's time to get the party started. See y'all next time. Hey. Hey. Hi. Something smells so good. I brought wine. Thanks. Y'all come on in. Party on, BB. See y'all next time on BB's Back Burner.